Growth hack number 15 is really around understanding your lead acquisition. So a couple of numbers you really need to know is how much does it cost me to acquire a customer and how much is that customer worth to me? So thinking about the lifetime value, not just that first purchase, but the lifetime value of that customer is X. How much are you then prepared to pay in your cost of acquisition to obtain a lead that then converts into that customer? And remember, not all your leads will convert 100%. So again, think about how much you spend to get a customer. You may need to divide by your conversion rate. Now, once you know your conversion and also the amount you're prepared to spend, then think about, OK, now it's the acquisition cost. How much am I paying at this moment in time to acquire a customer? So if I spend a pound here, how much am I likely to get as my return? So therefore, we can test and measure different marketing. But my growth hack today really wants to focus on one key area that we tend to forget, and that's reigniting old leads old leads that we didn't convert because we've done all the hard work we've acquired them up front we've spent the cost but during our journey we didn't convert in the way that we wanted to did we reflect at that moment and have we made learns continually but actually now we've got somebody in our database that quite often as i find just sits there and we hope that they might contact us again. But what are you doing proactively? And there's the key word, what are you doing proactively to reignite your leads, your prospects? Is there something that you learned during the process that if you gave it a period of time and had this systemized and process that you could follow up with them again and just check in with them? Even if they've chosen a competitor, could you check in and say, okay, well, the reason you chose the competitor over me was this, how's that experience been? Because I can assure you that sometimes it won't be um, the experience they thought they were going to get. So that may open a door for you, not immediately, but again in the future by keeping your brand and yourself in front of them. So think about your acquisition cost, how much you're prepared to pay for, for acquiring that type of customer. Are you spending that type of money? But importantly today, think about reigniting your existing and old leads. So my challenge today is to think about this week. What leads have you lost in the last year, two years, three years that you can go back to and reignite in some way? It may be an offer. It may be just sharing that piece of information that you forgot to share with them last time. It may be just a simple, simple email in terms of would you still be interested in talking again? But please follow up and try and reignite those leads.